Students across the nation are taking action to show their support for gun reform. It's all part of a national walkout, a move to demand action from lawmakers. Our Lee Waldman followed the students of Uvalde as they participated. We're here in the downtown plaza where there's crosses memorializing the 21 victims that were killed at Rom Elementary just last year. But around this area are students from schools all around Uvalde CISD. They're a part of a national school walkout that happened today. It was organized by Students Demand Action. Now, these students, they walked into the high school, middle school, and even some of the elementary schools in this area. They marched here to this plaza. They marched up and down the road. There were cars honking at them. And you can see they're holding signs that have some of the victims faces on them they're saying uh, no justice no peace they were chanting earlier at this point they're sitting here for 77 minutes that's how long it took for the gunman who entered rom elementary to be taken down by law enforcement i wanted you to hear from some of those kids this is what they had to say today i believe in this i believe in the cause so the consequences i might get i will pay um, as unfortunate as they may be i don't know but i'm protesting for what i believe in and these middle schoolers, these high schoolers, these are kids. And I'm so proud of them when they showed up here. I just wanted to say that. Now, I did speak with someone from Uvalde CISD earlier. They said that it was up to each of the principals where the students were going to be allowed to hold their walkouts. Uvalde CISD said the students were not going to be allowed to exit the fencing that was surrounding the schools. That was all a part of school safety. Now, as you can see, a lot of those kids did make their way out here. We have some of the Uvalde CISD police department here that was escorting them along the way. This is a very, very peaceful protest, but all of these young people say they're here for one thing, and that is to end gun violence. And Uvalde, Lee Waldman, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.